Do you remember the case that we did last? Wasn't that the one with the pipe and the lady and the guy who was cheating on her with some person in Seattle and stuff like that? Oh, yeah. They killed a pig. The console's car. Okay, we're gonna keep this short. I'm already late for the DA. First up, Phelps, Bukowski. We've got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off 2nd Street between Olive and Grand. PR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. Oh, okay. Well, unrude. That's or unrude. It? Did you say that was unrude? Rimsky, Ohio. Yeah, I don't, don't Intelligence has information. We're here. The two best detectives and one brain is here. Oh, this freaking person. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Phelps, traffic. I'm Officer Houlihan. 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 Sounds like wow from Lion King. Houlihan. Wow. Houlihan. We got a call about an abandoned vehicle? Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? There he is. No. You yeah, see him back Jake there? over there was on station uh, before yeah. I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Give us some time right. to look the place over. I got this. Sure, take your time. He's a sore-headed old son of a bitch anyway. Wow. All right, all right. No, 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 no. you can't just talk to him immediately. We have to investigate. I remember all of this, Corey. It's owned by the Argentinian embassy. Paul Manor. Old Davis. General of Argentina. Okay. Oh, there's the Argentinian flag. Oh yeah. Oh, it's missing another flag. I must have taken the flag as a souvenir. Can't have it any street value. How dare you say that? On D Street, they don't have any value. It's missing a tire. And license plate. Who would just take a singular tire, though? Stealing the wheels is for amateurs. Car oh, rental is stripped in a warehouse. Okay. Come on now, let me back out. Anything in the tier room? Empty. It has a box. Empty. It's not empty. Yeah, there's a box. There's a box there. Oh, and they took the back license, too. What are you looking at? Oh, yes. Ball. What are you taking photos of? Oh. Combination wrench. Must have used it to remove the wheel lugs. The doobie oh, No way. No way he just- he said that. That- that's not- no. Is that The reason why I'm saying that is because normally wheel, like, nuts are on super tight, and using a hand wrench like that would be actually miserable. That's probably why he only took one off. He's like, I can't do this. Alright, I think that's everything. Let's talk to- let's talk to ye old mans over here. Oswald Jacobs? That's right. <laughs> what exactly happened here, Mr. Jacob? Last night, I was looking He's... out of my window. <laughs> oh my gosh. I like to keep an eye on what's going on. I can understand that. He looks you see high. This animated log? face. Damn kids play stickball here. Always breaking my windows. Always asking for their ball back. Can we get back These to the darn car, kids. Mr. Jacobs? Don't be impatient, Sonny. Anyway, Sunny. last night I see this brand spanking new Packard up on bricks. Get that wee niche report. Even in his like picture of him drawn, he looks high. He's only 65? Did you see okay. who stole the Packard? Hell yes, I did. I saw three goddamn Mexicans going to work on it. He's giving straight on eyes. He's telling the truth. You agree? Yeah, I agree. Can you tell us what they were doing? Using the headlights of an old Ford so they could strip the thing. I yelled out to them, I'll call the cops. So they loaded up their car and drove off, tooting and hollering and yelling obscenities at me in Mexican. You speak Spanish, <laughs> sir? No, I do not. 
<laughs> oh <my> God. <laughs> How dare you ask me? How dare you ask me? I just know. After the uh, Mexicans left, you didn't go anywhere near the car? After I scared them off? No, I didn't go anywhere near that car. <laughs> There's the face! <laughs> God! Mm, I'm not lying, I'm not lying. Uh, we did. <laughs> what would that be? Would that be doubt? Or I would think that that's be doubt. We don't have evidence. That face is really strong. I think it has to be doubt. It has to be doubt. <laughs> I think uh, I think he's lying. I think if you can't tell, he's a little bit lying. Los more. Angeles finest, huh? God help us all. Yeah, you're great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you look like you're about to cry. You went out to the car. Once they were gone, you had to take a look for yourself. I was curious. Ain't a law against that. So what if I took a look around that car? You can't be accusing me of nothing. Tell me about the car they were driving. It was an old Ford. I didn't catch the license number. That's a truth. There's no, there's yeah, no wincing there. Why did the well, okay? Never mind. For me, the quality just got really fuzzy. Yeah, I saw that too. You look like the kind of guy who notices details. You're right there. The car was old, but it looked brand new. Candy apple red paint job stands out a mile. Okay. Right, what three exactly for did four. you see them take? They was working on the tires. That's all that was took. He's lying. <laughs> That's his, that, he's definitely lying right here because we have evidence that the license plates were taken. Yeah. Why did you take the license plate? Me? Well, what I do with license plates? You saying I have them? They missing. And the Argentinian flag's missing. Yeah. Oh, oh he angry. Oh, yeah. that's just angry. Ooh, he's angry. Ooh, angry. Hey, I paid my mean? taxes, so do some goddamn work. Wow. <laughs> Scratching what? around in that book won't prove nothing. You should show me some respect. Was that his doubt face? Was that just another out. doubt? Speak to Officer Tabo about signing a formal statement. When you get the car out of the way, if you could come back and do something about those kids. How about we bring you an umpire's mask? So Jacob I guess that was a doubt was then. In a hurry when we walked up. I don't know. Because what? Didn't want that, what? Cause the license, like, let me see. And the missing Argentinian flag. Yeah, he was talking about the license plates, but I guess we just didn't. We don't have information on. I guess that was stolen Packard. Oh. The car. Yeah. Sorry, I don't know my cars. I don't either, but it, they've been talking about a stolen packer this entire time. We just look at. Okay, so we have the owner of the vehicle, a degenerate. I'll run John Madsen by R and I. Uh, where where else? Oh. Contact details on a William Dewey. This looks like business rather than pleasure. Bro left his book here so we can look at all this. Willie Gable, very pale. <laughs> Timothy Stobo, slim hips. What is oh, what nice. is this? Dark good looks. Oh, we just stole brother's, that. Brother is sitting there like fantasizing. I think we've run this place dry. Find a game well. See, that's what we need to hear. Him telling us, like, there's nothing else to look for. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? Could you run the name Dewey Brothers? Possibly a dealership or car mechanics workshop. One moment. Dewey Brothers Packard Dealership, 629 Figueroa Street. Got it. Can you put me through to Michigan 2458, please? Connecting you now. 
Oh, these are phone numbers? Hello, can I help you? LAPD, ma'am. Can I speak to John Madsen, please? He's at school, officer. Uh, what's this about? Is he in trouble? How old is your boy, ma'am? Just turned 16. Wrong person, Mrs. Madsen. Sorry to disturb you. Corey! What? The Messages old man is a peed! There's just one message for you, oh. detective. He yeah. was writing about boy, like boys! Like young boys! Robert, 706, was reported missing this morning by Juan Francisco Valdez. Could you have him brought in? He's already here at Central, detective. He's demanding an audience, as he calls it. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, so you can you get a message smoking. to Captain Leary? Tell him we'll be in as soon as Don't we can. Smoke. This has got to be the 50th abandoned vehicle call whoa, we've got whoa, this year. Whoa, One more whoa. and those are stairs. Crazy. Those are not your favorite cases. You kidding me? This is barely even police work. Of all the bad guys in this city, we get <laughs> okay. lucky ones who can't even nice. sure. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I'm good at this game. Do we have a Juan Francisco Valdez in for questioning. Sure do, Phelps. Your bird's an in interview, too. And get this, he's wearing gloves and doing his best not to touch anything. Can you beat that? <laughs> Sounds like we don't want to keep this guy waiting. It's this way. I've been he was just prepping for COVID. What are you guys talking about? What, 50 years in That's not like advance? He knew. 60, 70, 70 years in advance? He knew. About time. Are you in the gloves? Officer That's his gloves, Corey. He's I'm wearing brown gloves, Corey. Have you any idea how long I've been waiting to speak with you? I am needed back at the consulate, and you keep me here like a common criminal. All right, friend. Let's take a deep breath and start all over again. Mr. Baldess. Counsel General. I insist on my full title. What? Counsel yeah, General? Where did you purchase that car? My secretary and driver arranged the purchase. A disreputable place, a Dewey Brothers by name. As soon as I can have it arranged, I will have my Hispano Suiza brought up from Buenos Aires. I know that's how it's pronounced. I I mean I don't I, we don't <laughs> we don't really have anything to doubt Is that this. Doubt? That's doubt. I don't know. He could be telling the truth, and that's his truth face. You want to flip a coin right. on it? Hey Siri. No, I, okay. Okay, I got I flip got tails. Flip a coin. It's heads. He's telling the truth. Okay. He's telling the truth. He wasn't telling the truth. You think someone from the garage could have been involved in the theft? It would not surprise me in the least. Um. Mm. Um. Mm. Anyways, theft of the consular vehicle. Consul General, we have located your car. Can you tell us how it was stolen? It must have been stolen from the consular garage. Terribly inconvenient, of course. I want the perpetrator soundly flogged. Unfortunately, we don't do that here, Your Worship. <laughs> See, that's... See, that's his true face. Are you sure? Look at that. He's Wait. like, uh... No, that's his doubt again. That's not freaking truth. Is that doubt? Doubt. Go ahead. Wait, wait, wait. Uh... Yeah. You have yeah, a pretty doubt. good idea who stole the car, don't you, Consul General? Are you going to tell me, or do I shake it out of you? There's no call for violence. I suspect a disgruntled boy from the car dealership. Okay. You have a name for this kid? 50. Gabriel, like the archangel. I have no surname. Oh, uh, okay. So tell us about this kid, Gabriel. You had a run-in with him? Mechanical. A presumptuous young man who did not know his place. He presumed to ask me questions. We do a lot of presuming here in the United States, Consul General. It comes with the turf. He's looking away a lot now. Oh, 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 it's the book. You it's fuck young book. boys, Valdez. Oh, yes! Man. There you this go! Let's go! Incident. I'm a genius. I am a genius. I'm a genius. The way how he just said it outright, though! Danny, Ben, Miguel, Tristan, and Teddy. Full lips. Ring any bells? I'm sure we can come to some. Oh my gosh! Gabriel, 
spill it. A beautiful but impertinent boy. I mentioned rendezvous and the young man went quite insane. I thought he was going to kill me. I was prepared to pay. Ew! We'll be in touch, Consul General. Kill him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Where's the gun? Shoot him! Punch! Punch! We're ready to punch! Uh, where's my inventory? Uh, I'm trying to scroll through my inventory. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> this is like Fortnite, right? <laughs> He's disgusting! Can we arrest I him? Just my you have young boys! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> 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 Don't tell me, let me guess. You were making your way past the lot, caught sight of the new model four door and couldn't help yourself. You could see yourself in that car and just had to take a closer look. Well, I can't say as I blame you. <laughs> uh, nice smile. LAPD, Mac. We'd like to speak with the owner. That's me, William Dewey, proprietor at your service. We're investigating the theft of a Packard belonging to the Argentine embassy. Are you missing a combination wrench? I don't know, detective, but I know how we can find out. Follow me. He's a good dude. You think he's good? I think he's a little creepy. He look no, his teeth are bothering me. But his smile. He's, he's give me, give me a good dealership smile, Corey. For me, it's. Uh... We keep all our oh. tools in here. Oh, a little smolder smile. <laughs> Mind if we look around? Be my guest. Oh, you great. sure you guys aren't interested in a new car? It was huh? a three-quarter. It was a three-quarter. Maybe a used car. Yeah, I have, I to have do some all this nice used cars for guys in your wage bracket. Boop. You liars down here. Why don't you give us some here. alone time, Dewey? Go sell some cars or whatever it is that you do. See, I got this. I don't need you. Oh, I was right. It was the three quarter, but of the Gabriel. Uh... One left. Gabriel Delgado is missing a three quarter. If you don't mind, yeah, we fun. have a few questions. Oh, great. Look at that smile. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> Packards are great cars, but this doesn't look like the kind of place favored by foreign embassies. How do you know about this? I don't know Valdez. The embassy bought the car. All I know is he must know a quality car when he sees one. I mean, he's doing the trout mouth. He's, he's, he's honest. You think that's honest? That's honesty. Not looking away, nothing. He has his phone number. In the... In the book. Is this not William Dewey? That's William Dewey. So why does he have his phone number? In the oh. child book. Oh, I guess you could put it then. And I know a shyster when I see one. You and Valdez <laughs> are in this together. Me and Valdez? I hardly know him. Valdez wouldn't wipe his shoes with me. Plus, that's Valdez's book and he look has his him. number. Look at, so it's look just... at him. Look at him. He's... Oh, you're right. He's nervous. Oh, you can back out of an accusation. That's true. Yeah, you can. We found your contact details in Valdez's notebook. He had to be calling you for something, do we? Okay. So I met Valdez in a bar. We cut a deal. He bought the car through the embassy. I cut him some change on the side. It happens all the time. Why are you in the child predator book, Huey? Or William? Why did I say Huey? Huey Dewey. Dewey. Yui, yui, dewey, 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 Where can we find Pinky? Delgado? I don't know. He sure as hell isn't here. That's a lie. Or is that a doubt? That's a, that's a doubt. We doubting him? Yeah, that's a doubt. Address, Let's Dewey. Go. Or my partner shoves her head in a car door. Okay, all right. Apartment 3, 103 Hill Street. And tell him from me. If he ever shows his face around here again, I'm gonna kick his butt from here to kingdom come. Kingdom come? Here to kingdom where? French used in auto theft. Oh, he's angry. 
He's so angry. A wrench from this dealership was used to strip the wheels from a Packard last night, Mr. Dewey. A couple of Hispanics were seen taking parts. We've had a spate of thefts ourselves. Comes with the location. Even bastards to steal anything the minute your back is turned. I think he's telling the truth. That's the truth, face. That's on direct eye contact. Yeah, and his mouth is not doing anything dumb. No, no it's so a wait, lie. What? Like what? I said, the workshop's too close to the street. It's difficult to keep an eye on it. Thank you for your help, Mr. That Dick. was his lying face? No problem. God damn that kid. I'm just an honest car salesman. Seems like you just don't know who you can trust these days. <sighs> Going yeah, to movies, you. Dewey, you're missing your calling. Time to visit Gabriel Delgado. You see how freaking... good his excuse is. Like, uh, what? Like, how the Fiesta looked really good with that blue on it? Mm-hmm. I have an impartial, uh, Okay, let's see what Gabriel has to say for, for me. I just hope our Forgotten Angel baby. hasn't already flown. The it got Ford gold Fiesta. on it! It got gold on it, I mean, I can go in. Gold. Punk. Whoa! <laughs> yet. LAPD, ma'am. We're looking for Gabriel Delgado. Gabriel? We're from the police. Policia, you understand? Yes, I understand. Could you come inside? What is your name? Ana Rodriguez. Is Gabriel Delgado here, Ms. Rodriguez? No. What do you want with Gabriel? Is he in trouble? Stay where you are, Miss Rodriguez. We need to take a look around. But he is not here. I have told you. Check He's out here. the surrounds. I'll stay with the broad. Broad? I'll stay with the broad. He's here. He's here. You ready so for a chase down? how far along are you, Anna? Nearly 20 weeks. Right. So how's it going to be when you go into labor and he's not around? All right, this looks like the method of escape whenever... Oh, there's a shed back there. Oh, there's so much to look at. Okay, maybe I should just look at everything first. Unless you help us here, Anna, your little one won't be seeing Papa for a very Serving long time. Serving breakfast for two, Anna? You should have cleared up. Whether it's the suspect vehicle from the scene. Huh. Certainly Gabriel's pride and joy. I'm assuming we shan't talk to her. Um, let's go out to that shed before I say a word to her. Oh, look at all these license plates. Yeah. What's up with this one? Is this the one? Oh, that's the diplomat. Diplomatic license oh. plates. Oh, where? Oh, these mean nothing. Come on now. Alpine. This means nothing too. Stop it. Is that the tire? It looks like Valdez gets his wheel back. Oh, he took the spare, too. Yeah, that's why there was none in the uh, trunk. You're in serious trouble, Miss Rodriguez. But Gabriel is not here. I have done nothing wrong. Why did he steal the car, Anna? The customer insulted him. He has his honor, no? What? You steal a car because of an insult? That seems a bit... much... I think she's telling the truth, though. Yeah. His honor, Anna? He said Dewey's friend tried to make a woman out of him. He no longer respects this man, Dewey. He took the car to show this maricon that he is a man. Okay. Tell us the truth, Anna. Has Gabriel been here? I haven't seen him for at least three nights. Alright, she lying. Do we have actual evidence? The food, the yes. Food, yeah, no, no, food, I know she's lying. Food. I was just making sure that we had like 
in our notes that we had breakfast plates <laughs> here. You filthy liar. Have you no shame? You keep lying to me, and I'll send you and your baby to jail. That's not legal. He lives here, but he hasn't come it's home. It's aiding and abetting. It actually is. I swear it. The baby's part of it too, then? Yeah, the baby can. Enough, Anna. The baby gonna get some signs all over tattoos. This place that he's been back. He was here last night. That's not breakfast. I have never seen him so angry. He went out to his shed and put some things in it. I don't know what and I don't want to know. I love him. All right, now let's lie to her and tell her that he killed 15 people on a diplomat. We Let's found a baby. license plate <laughs> matching our stolen vehicle in the shed. Add in the assortment of parts, and we can make Gabriel for a dozen other thefts. It's time to get serious, Anna. You must ask these questions of Gabriel. I know nothing of these car parts. She's looking away a lot. Unless, unless, <laughs> she's got some attitude. She's like, mm-hmm. I don't know about these parts. The steak face. Yeah, she's like, I don't know about you and your ugly suit, but I have no idea what these parts are the for. Mm -mm, truth mm -mm. or doubt? You think that's a doubter? That looks like a truth. She's telling you it's a truth in her head. She just says that she doesn't know what he put in the shed. So I think... It was a doubter? As much as we do, Anna. Tell us where we can find it. Freaking God. Don't get it. You pretend to be concerned for me. But you would take him straight from here to a cell. Oh my gosh. This is... This is pissing me off. Okay, let's let's start focusing and listening to, to the one detective here that knows what he's doing, alright? Oh, what are you trying to say? Gabriel wasn't at work. Where can we find him? He said he would never go back. Gabriel is out driving around in his car. If you don't tell me what? where he it's is, right now, that was a truth. I'll that was a truth. And ask them to shoot on sight. That was a truth. Please, please don't kill him. I can't tell you anymore. As soon as we corner Gabriel, we'll be back for you, Anna. I had a feeling you that was a truth. I didn't realize away. you were going to make assumptions without me. Get out of here, Phelps. Don't worry. I've got an idea. You never up. understood it. The more rotten the boyfriend, the more loyal the girl will be. She's going to Oh, now since we got it wrong, we have to follow her. What? We're following her? Oh. Here, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I am the master of stealth. Why is this car like this? Let me the car. This isn't even the car I that you got. That's you. No, not better because it actually can turn. What? Oh, it is them. There's the red Ford. That's Delgado right there. This is all you. This is all you. You gotta chase him down. How bunga? Get the red one. Get the red one. Phelps, 1247. Requesting assistance at first and Santa Fe. That's how fast you're gonna go? Holding W. Stay on the Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They're kidding you. They're kidding you. <laughs> It's almost impossible to pit someone in this game. Step on it, Phelps. Take him out. That looks like you're planning to pit. Come on. 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 I can salvage! <laughs> you can't! Where are you going? You don't know where he went! <laughs> <laughs> Dang it, man. I got it. Oh. Alright, let's see if you actually went the right way. You did it! Oh. Step on Five. Him. Take him out! Lay into his wheel arches. Come on. Lay into his wheel? So hit him? Yeah. Come on. He's got a tree by a kid in a red fort. 
kind of hard to do. I'm not going fast enough. Oh, I was there. Come in. Come in. God damn it, Cole. Hold it steady. Whoa! Whoa, wait. Whoa. Oh, he's done for. Nice. All right, now we kill him. Get out of the car. Corey, this is your thing! Oh, wait, yeah, no! Yeah, yeah. Gabriel Delgado, you're under arrest for Grand Theft Auto. Hey, it's a game. Fuck you, puto! You should speak to the maricón! Valdez, I showed him! Now who's a man? I should've burned his fucking car! Okay. That's a... good reason. Definitely angry. You got a foreign dignitary out it as a fruit and a kitty raper. A car dealer we're gonna let slide for the kickbacks. And a street punk car thief who sure as hell won't be taking liberties with other people's autos again anytime soon. That, Detective Phelps, is not a bad haul. You keep your chin low and your hands high, and you keep bringing me clearances just like that one. That's textbook policing, and we need more of it in this department. It's pretty solid. Because he's just here. He's just existing. Yeah, he has no praise at all. Helps is just doing all the work. You're existing. That's all you're good for. Oof. Yikes. Oof. Let's look at his injuries. Hold on. No injuries. <gasps> what? We need to really, like, hone in on the questioning. It's the hardest part, too. You have any plans for Weekend Liberty, Jack? My sisters have been working in Los Angeles in a bomber factory. They're coming down to visit. I'm meeting them at the station at 6. Good for you, Jack. Are they cute? They're my sisters, Hank. Attention! Final inspection before Liberty. Good job, Kelso. Are we going somewhere, gentlemen? Full inspection! It had better be exceptional if any of you want liberty this weekend. Kelso, this carbine. The bore is dirty. No, it isn't. Are you arguing with me, Kelso? Do what you need to do, Sergeant. You know the bore is immaculate. Weekend liberty canceled. <laughs> My two day field drill. Clean this rifle. No. Do you know the penalty for insubordination, Kelso? Jack, don't do it. Forget him, Hank. He doesn't have what it takes. Are you two finished? Are you going to clean this rifle? No, Sergeant. Cole is right. I'm going to stop playing games and join a rifle company and fight the real enemy. 